We love taking you behind the scenes in our favorite Broadway productions. That's why John sat down and talked with Emily Bainhe, who plays the Wicked Witch's sister, the Wicked Witch of the East. You know, the one that Dorothy's house falls on when she lands in Oz. Yes, we're talking about Broadway Across America's Wicked. This is not your first Broadway production, is that correct? It's not. Well, um, this is my first uh, Broadway tour. Um, I did tour with Beauty and the Beast, and we toured through Indianapolis about two years ago, and we played at Clues Hall. So it's uh, great to be back. Well, that's fantastic. Now, Belle, that's obviously a fantastic role to be in, and Nesseros is a bit different of a character. Tell us a little bit about that switch. Yes, a bit different. So, I mean, obviously we all know Belle. She's the amazing, iconic um, Disney princess. I think the best one. I'm a little biased. I would agree with you on that. Yeah. Um, but, you know, she's real level-headed, and she's really intelligent and a very grounded character. Um, She's similar to Nessa Rose in those ways, but I also think that Nessa Rose tends to be more self-centered <laughs> rather than selfless like Belle, um, and she tends to lash out when she doesn't get what she wants. It's the untold story of the Witches of Oz. So you learn um, about Glinda the Good before she was named that, and you also learn about Elphaba before she is called the Wicked Witch of the West. So you really learn the tales behind the Tin Man, the tales behind uh, the lion, um, all of those things that the Wizard of Oz is so well known for and that we love about Wizard of Oz. You get to kind of see the expanded story in this production. Tell them how I am defying gravity. My favorite song is Defying Gravity and I think that's one of the most popular numbers in the show, in fact. The lyrics are so powerful and the set and the lighting, it's a great, ending to act one. I hope you're, happy. you're originally from Indiana. You have Hoosier roots. Tell us about that. Hoosiers. Yeah, Hoosiers. Yeah. Um, yes, I uh, grew up in Silver Lake, Indiana, um, and went to Warsaw High School in Warsaw, Indiana, and then attended Ball State University um, in Muncie. So I am so happy to be back home, especially over Thanksgiving. Well, you had mentioned about bringing some of your high school uh, students from your own high school. They're coming to see you. Uh, what advice would you have for someone that wants to get into Broadway or wants to pursue a career in the entertainment industry like you? Starting now, take classes, workshops, um, come see shows. That's the best um, learning tool is watching other people work and I that's one of my favorite things to do is to watch other people work and learn from them um, read as much as you can go to auditions because uh, as an actor what you mostly do is audition <laughs> it's it's not as glamorous as it sounds so um, I think just learning all that you can and also having um, interests outside of acting outside of theater I think just makes you a more well-rounded person as well as a a more well-rounded actor. You can just bring more to the table. 